Okay, here we go. This is going to be a, a bit of a whatever. Je ne fume pas. I don't smoke. So je ne fume pas. Okay, let's make that quite clear. There's a lovely long phrase coming up here. Le tabagan, la tabagisme. Okay, le tabagisme. C'est décutant. So décutant. Okay, let's have a look at what we got down here. Okay, décutant. So this is a bit of a, in terms of accents, this is going to be um, a bit of a complex word to put together. Look at that, décutant, disgusting. Décutant means disgusting. And then je déteste. So je déteste. Let's take um, the part from here. Uh, da, da, de, a bit of music as we go along. So, je déteste quand, when, les autres, when the others, it's a plural, fume, when the others smoke. All right? So, a is one of the verbs, like so. Déteste is another verb, a strong opinion, if you like. Les autres fume. Fume as you smoke, the others smoke. Okay. Now, say, okay, let's revert back to the, what we got here. Say, uh, vraiment impoli. So, vraiment, really. Impoli means impolite. So, it's really impolite, okay? So, really, really impolite. C'est vraiment impoli. And then, je ne sortirai now sortir is to go out it's conditional I wouldn't go out I would never go out okay jamais uh, I would never go out uh, avec with I have um, now un fumeur with a smoker a masculine that would be a masculine un fumeur or uh, une f uh, fumeuse Fumeur, fumeuse. All right, so they decided to put a lovely long sentence there for us. Have a good look at it. Okay. Um, I think, yeah, so the tabagisme, c'est dégoûtant, it's disgusting. Je déteste quand les autres fument. I hate it when others smoke. C'est vraiment impoli, it's really uh, impolite. Je ne sauterai jamais. I'll never go out with a smoker avec un fumeur ou une fumeuse. Right. By the same token, we could replace le tabagisme and talk about alcohol. L'alcool, c'est des coutons. Okay, so instead of uh, fumant, we have fume, sorry, fumant even. Boive, because you don't pronounce the NT. Les autres boivent. Je déteste quand les autres boivent, when the others drink. C'est vraiment impoli. And then we could uh, simply replace that last word there with. Uh, so if it lets me, yeah, it's going to let me. Now, uh, un or une, okay, just use one word, alcoolique. Alcoolique, comme ça. Alcoolique. Excellent. Right. So a nice long phrase there. Have a good look at it because I'm going to get rid of all that. So take a good look. Okay, and let's move on to the third thing. I smoke. Do I? Je fume, I smoke. Mais, but, je ne deviendrai, I would never become a drug, a drug addict. So, deviendrai jamais. Okay, okay, je fume, I smoke, mais je ne deviendrai, I would never become. So, again, conditional. See the AIS on the end there? Deviendrai would become. Actually. Now, so what I'm going to do. So, jamais. Now, uh, drug addict is this word here. Toxicoma. So, toxicoma, c'est ça. So, c'est trop dangereux. C'est trop dangereux, non? So, let's just... Uh, a is too dangerous. 
c'est trop dangereux. So any alternatives that we could have here, we could again, okay, je bois, I drink. Okay, and then start replacing what we got on here instead. Okay, um, I drink, but I would never smoke, for example. So, fumerai. Je bois, mais je ne fumerai, but I would never smoke. Yeah, I would never smoke. Um, uh, but we need to get rid of that as well because that only goes with drugs. Yeah, am I right? Now, obviously, if I was to put in this one, that's a bit of a contradiction because that literally means I drink, but I would never drink. So, we'd have to go back to fume for that one. Obviously. Okay. Obviously, obviously, obviously. So, anyway, moving on. Now, I like smoking it will be j'aime fumer. So, j'aime, okay, uh, acting similar to a modal verb. And then fumer, okay, I like smoking. Right. So, fifth one, let's have a look at this phrase down here. When I smoke, um, I re relax, and so on. Let's have a look at it. So, here we go. Quand je fume, when I smoke. Quand je fume, okay, je me détron. So, détron, c'est ça ici. Okay, let's just bring it down here. So, je me détron. Uh, je me détends et je sais que I know that ce n'est pas okay it's going to be a really these are really long sentences in this one here ça it isn't healthy mais but uh, je pense que I think that c'est cool hmm, et dangereux non Okay, so, so, quand je fume, when I smoke, je me détends, I relax. So, détendre, reflexive verb, to relax. Je sais que, I know that, ce n'est pas, it isn't, Sam, healthy, mais je pense, I think, c'est cool, it is cool. Okay, not particularly wise, but there we are. Okay, let's just get rid of what we got on there. And let's take us into the sixth part. So, uh, thankfully, it's forbidden to smoke in public places. So, thankfully, is heureusement. So, heureusement, malheureusement, is unfortunately. Il est interdit. It is forbidden. De fumer. To smoke. Okay, dans... Les lieux, dans les lieux publics, comme ça, mesdames et messieurs. Okay, so the verbs that we've got here is uh, to smoke, de fumer, dans les lieux publics. So have a good look at that because I've only just uh, typed out number five here, but I'm going to have to get rid of it. So have a good look at it before I do. Okay, it's gone now. Now, I stopped smoking a year ago. So that would be j'ai arrêté now. Okay, just bear with me on this one. Okay, arrêté. Um, oh, come on, come on. Arrêté. Oui, c'est ça. De fumer. So we don't want it there. We want it here. De fumer. Have a good look at it. I have stopped to smoke le Il y a. Set phrase for a go. Il y a. Un. Un. Okay. One year ago. So. A. Auxiliary verb. Let's highlight it. Then we've got the uh, past participle. Arrête. To smoke. De fumer. Okay. Then goes just here. So arrête de fumer. Il y a. Un. 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 All right, mesdames et numéro 8. Qu'est-ce que nous avons? So, I was starting to have health problems. Je commence. Okay. Here we have it. Let's get it in 
Yes, je commence. Okay, I was starting. A avoir, to have. Uh, too many accents. Okay, here we go. Okay, à avoir, to have. Um, des problèmes. Okay. Okay, so we've got the problem. Comme ça, mesdames, monsieur. Let's get it right. J'ai uh, commencé à avoir des problèmes uh, de santé. Uh, de santé. Okay. Let's see, I must confess. English, we don't have any accent. So in this regard, in terms of making videos, it's a lot easier. I'm doing it in English. English even. Right, j'ai commencé à avoir des problèmes de santé. I was starting to have health problems. Right, so instead of saying that, we can have uh, other phrases, can, can we not? Yes? Okay, so let's have a look at uh, number nine. So we could have instead, um, I had trouble breathing. So, j'avais, so j'avais uh, du mal à respirer. Okay. Um, respirer to breathe, yeah. Surtout, above all, literally, uh, en faisant while doing, en faisant du sport while doing sport. Okay, I had trouble breathing, especially when doing sport. Yeah, I had. Okay, so come on. Just let me hold like the little bits. So, j'avais respiré to breathe, surtout en faisant while doing du sport, doing sport. Right, excellent. Now, okay, what else could we have? I uh, couldn't afford it. So, so, ça, so we got that. Um, me coûte. All right. Okay, quickly, does it? Come on, come on, come on. I'm actually trying. I've got a 15 minute limit, as you know, with regards to YouTube. I'm, I think you can go over 15 these days, but I don't know. Sama Kute. Okay, that costed me, literally. I couldn't afford it. That costed me too expensive, literally. Sa good. Okay, trop cher. Il y a. Uh, there is, or there was, or there is, sorry, there's too much. Il y a trop de tax. There's too much tax sur le tabac. Mais oui. So, okay, got that there. I highlighted the verbs. I paused the button. I'm getting clever at this. No, I'm not really. Right, so, mon grand-père. So, you got mon grand-père, mesdames, monsieur. Okay, you know, copy... It's a bit of a fine line, this one. Get in there. Come on, come on, come on. Mon grand-père. Uh, who has had, literally, une crise. Okay. Cardiac. So, a, uh, literally a cardiac crisis. A uh, heart attack, yes. Uh, we will cause it in English. Ah. Okay. Come on, come on. Uh, due to a uh, cause du tabagisme. Look at that. Okay, so the auxiliary guys like so, and then who is from avoir, uh, the past participle, a uh, cause du tabagisme. Yeah, we could have uh, lung cancer, which is un cancer. Okay, uh, du poumon. Okay, mon grand-père a eu un cancer de poumon à cause de tabagisme. My grandfather had uh, lung cancer due to smoking. And we've got it within the 15 minutes, ladies and gents.